Nature doesn't create perfect angles, but the Hubble Space Telescope has just found them. Frankly, what I'm about to show you shouldn't exist. Deep within the faint light of the interstellar object 3I Atlas, Hubble has revealed three distinct streams of matter erupting to form a perfect equilateral triangle. They are precisely 120 degrees apart, a mathematical symmetry so precise that the statistical probability that it's a random coincidence in nature is only 0.2%. That's a probability of 1 in 500. We were searching for a comet, but the shape we found resembled an architectural structure. It's the kind of discovery that changes everything we've ever known about rocks floating in space. But what really puzzled me was, if this wasn't a miracle of physics, then we were witnessing a deliberately orchestrated sign. Welcome back to the shadows. This is the mystery of 3i Atlas. For months, we've been observing this object drifting through the solar system, assuming it was just another silent traveler from the stars. But as it drew closer, Larsen Sekinina filters peeled away layers of dust to reveal a core that defies conventional science. We're no longer talking about ice and gas. We're talking about a structure that appears to be stabilizing itself with absolute precision. Could this be a new type of comet, or is the 0.2% probability telling us we're not alone in this silence? Today, we'll explore Atlas's impossible geometry, the data that's been the subject of much debate in astronomy, and what might happen when this visitor finally approaches the king of the planets. When we gaze up at the starry sky, we often forget that our vision is never direct. Between us and the universe lies a thick veil of interstellar dust, light pollution from Earth, and the inherent limitations of observational technology. Space may be infinite, but human vision is not. Therefore, to access and understand the 3 eye atlas, scientists are forced to use methods that go far beyond conventional observation. Between November and December of last year, the Hubble Space Telescope was fixedly focused on a faint, slowly drifting bright spot against the deep black backdrop of the universe. A total of 17 images were captured. In their raw data form, these images are almost unremarkable, just a pale white streak that most observers would overlook. However, that faint streak is actually a halo, a massive cloud of gas and dust surrounding the core of 3i Atlas triggered when solar radiation begins to heat and release frozen matter on its surface. Further analysis revealed that this data was far from simple. Independent research groups continued to reprocess the Hubble image series at higher resolution, incorporating new dynamic models to eliminate the influence of background noise. One of the most important tools used was the larsen sekinina rotating gradient filter a technique designed to separate structures with actual movement from seemingly meaningless, chaotic dust clouds. When this filter was applied, the image of 3i Atlas changed dramatically. The hazy halo almost disappeared, revealing an internal structure that stunned scientists. Instead of the chaotic jets of gas seen in most known comets, 3i Atlas displayed three distinct, thin, straight, and clearly defined streams of gas, resembling needle-like streaks through space. What is noteworthy is the arrangement of these three gas streams. They don't appear randomly, but form a rare symmetrical configuration, strongly reminiscent of directional stability models in aerospace engineering. In the most conservative interpretation, this phenomenon could be related to localized active regions located precisely on the rotation axis of the 3i Atlas core, or a heterogeneous internal structure causing gases to escape in fixed directions. However, the deeper the analysis, the more the purely natural models require very precise conditions to reproduce this level of order. Recent analytical updates also show that the intensity of the three gas streams tends to stabilize over time, rather than fluctuating wildly, as is often seen in icy objects subjected to thermal stress. This is a small but important detail, as it raises questions about the object's internal regulation mechanisms. Some bolder hypotheses suggest that 3i Atlas may possess a special core structure, perhaps even partially hollow, allowing matter to escape through pre-shaped channels. On the boundary between science and speculation, there are also opinions questioning whether this could be a form of defunct technology relic that has retained its stable geometry after interacting with the stellar environment. 
The lingering feeling is that we are observing something that doesn't quite fit the familiar image of an iceberg wandering among the stars. While all the design and technological theories remain unproven, the very degree of order and balance that 3i Atlas exhibits is enough to challenge traditional understandings. As new data continues to be processed and compared, 3i Atlas quietly drifts through the solar system, as if deliberately leaving more questions than answers, and reminding us that the universe is still full of things that keep human curiosity at bay. Let's start with the 0.2% figure a seemingly dry detail that is becoming the focal point of the entire story. In science, researchers don't just observe phenomena, they track the sigma value, a statistical measure that indicates how certain it is that what is being seen is a genuine signal, not the product of random noise or observational error. When calculations show that the probability of a structure appearing by chance is extremely low, the scientific question no longer stops at, is there something unusual? but shifts to a much deeper issue, what created it. In nature, symmetry is always the exception, not the rule. It usually only appears on the microscopic scale, where the laws of quantum physics govern the structure of matter, or in biology, where natural selection favors shapes that are optimal in terms of energy and function. Hexagonal snowflakes, twisted seashells, or rounded petals all possess a distinct mathematical beauty. But on the cosmic scale, especially with the massive ice masses wandering between stars, symmetry has almost no place. The vast majority of comets and asteroids are distorted, asymmetrical, and chaotic, reflecting a history of collisions and erosion spanning billions of years. Therefore, what was observed on 3i Atlas became particularly difficult to ignore. The three streams of gas escaping from the object not only existed, but were also distributed approximately 120 degrees apart, a configuration so familiar it was almost iconic in engineering. For any engineer who had designed a satellite, spacecraft, or rotational stabilization system, this was the ideal ratio. The three evenly distributed forces formed a perfect isosceles triangle, helping the object maintain stability and limit oscillations in a zero-gravity environment. If a propulsion system had to be built to keep an object afloat in the darkness of space balanced, there would be no more effective way than this. Given the allure of these speculations, many mainstream researchers have called for caution. They argue that explanations based on known natural mechanisms should be prioritized. One popular hypothesis is that the 3i atlas may be a contact binary system, or even a triple system formed billions of years ago when separate ice masses collided at low speeds and stuck together. This is not uncommon in the solar system, particularly in the Kuiper Belt. According to this argument, if structurally weak regions or fissures are located precisely on the junctions, the escaping gas could create a pattern that appears organized, even if it is entirely natural. But then statistics presented a stark contrast. The probability of three independent vents being located at the same latitude, separated by almost exact longitude, and maintaining comparable activity levels is approximately 0.2%, or just one in 500. In observational science, this is not a number to be easily dismissed or attributed to luck. To better visualize this level of anomaly, imagine you walk into a dark room, close your eyes, and throw three random darts at a wall. When you turn on the light, the three darts not only stick to the wall, but also form a nearly perfect isosceles triangle. And this doesn't happen just once, but repeats every time the wall rotates in front of you. That's the level of randomness that the 3i Atlas data is suggesting. Avi Loeb, a Harvard astronomer known for asking unsettling questions about the possibility of extraterrestrial technology, argues that it's difficult to dismiss this as mere coincidence. He views this symmetry as a sign of potential technology. Loeb doesn't claim 3i Atlas is a spacecraft or an artificial device, but he poses a question that has forced the scientific community to reconsider. If it's just a rock, why is it so perfectly balanced? If we accept a purely natural explanation, then the 3i Atlas must be one of the luckiest objects ever to exist, with a nearly perfect geometric structure in a universe already full of chaos. Of course, counter-arguments exist. Some astronomers suggest that the object's rotational motion could force gas to escape through specific channels, creating the illusion of order. 
They argue that nature is capable of creating seemingly purposeful structures, even if they are merely the result of complex physical processes. This argument isn't wrong, but what puzzles many is the concept of efficiency. In engineering, symmetry is often synonymous with optimization. In nature, it rarely occurs on a large scale without a special underlying mechanism. Most remarkable of all is the relative silence following these discoveries. Before us is an interstellar object that doesn't spin chaotically as predicted, emitting jets of energy in a nearly perfect geometric pattern and seemingly responding to heat from the sun with a precision that defies complex physical models of ice, gas, and pressure. Avi Loeb's hypothesis may not be the final answer, but the feeling that 3i Atlas is more than just an inanimate piece of interstellar debris is increasingly difficult to ignore. If this isn't a rare miracle of natural geometry, then that 0.2% could be a sign, a faint signature left in the vastness of space, left by someone or something who understands the mathematics of the stars far more deeply than we do. And as scientists continue to dig deeper into the data from Hubble and upcoming observations, the 3 i atlas is increasingly becoming more of an encounter than a serendipitous discovery. Time is running out, and so is 3 i atlas. This interstellar object is approaching a pivotal moment, a moment that could confirm our boldest hypotheses or force the entire scientific community back to square one, confronting an even bigger question about what truly is drifting silently in the shadows between the stars. March 16, 2026 is becoming a particularly significant date in the history of modern astronomical observation. At that time, 3i Atlas will approach Jupiter at its closest distance, entering the gravitational field of the largest planet in the solar system. This is not simply a flyby in orbit, but a harsh and decisive test. Jupiter has long been considered the guard dog of the solar system, a gravitational giant with enough force to bend the orbits of celestial bodies, tear apart fragile comets, or permanently hurl them out of interplanetary space. Any object entering its territory is subject to the judgment of this almost merciless gravitational force. Therefore, the upcoming encounter is seen by scientists as a rare natural laboratory. NASA is preparing to utilize the Juno probe, which has orbited Jupiter for many years and understands the temperament of this giant gas planet to direct its sensors toward 3i Atlas. If the plan succeeds, this will be the closest human view ever of an interstellar visitor while it is still active still spewing matter and interacting directly with radiation from the sun. The data obtained will not only help determine the physical structure of 3i Atlas, but also allow testing of dynamic models under extreme gravitational conditions. What particularly caught the researchers' attention was the perplexing contrast in the object's structure. On one hand, 3i Atlas exhibited all the familiar characteristics of a comet with a massive chaotic dust tail stretching approximately 100,000 km toward the sun. It was the familiar image of heated ice and dust tossed about in an indefinite streak by the solar wind. But on the other hand, right at the core, only about 24,000 kilometers away, existed tiny, sharp, and surprisingly precise streams of gas. This coexistence of chaos and order baffled traditional explanatory models as if two different languages of physics coexisted within a single object. Some astronomers hypothesize that as 3i Atlas moves deeper into the solar system, it may be losing its outer layers of matter. This erosion could expose a previously unobserved core, where the internal structure is much more symmetrical than the chaotic outer shell. The contact binary star system hypothesis continues to be proposed to explain its unusual shape and behavior, but as analyzed, this model struggles to explain why the material flows maintain near-perfect equilibrium amidst the increasingly strong gravitational pull as it approaches Jupiter. Observational history shows that Jupiter is unforgiving to fragile intruders. The most famous case is Shoemaker-Levy 9, which was torn into 21 separate pieces by Jupiter's immense gravitational pull before each piece crashed to the planet's surface in 1994. It's a stark reminder that if 3i Atlas were merely a loose collection of ice and dust, March 16th could very well be the day it begins to disintegrate, leaving a trail of debris scattered around Jupiter's orbit. But it is the opposite scenario that is keeping scientists on edge. 
If 3I Atlas maintains its structure, if the three symmetrical gas streams continue to erupt at nearly 120 degrees, even under intense gravitational pull from Jupiter, then we are dealing with an object far more complex than a random inanimate rock. In that case, the possibility of an intrinsic stabilizing mechanism or even a form of deliberate navigation would be difficult to dismiss with simple explanations. Researchers will also closely monitor the phenomenon of unweighted acceleration, similar to what was previously observed at Oumuamua. If 3I Atlas systematically changes its orbit as it passes the king of planets, not just passively bent by gravity but exhibiting subtle adjustments, then this will no longer be an ordinary astronomical mystery. The object's behavior could then be interpreted as a signal, although it is unclear whether it is produced by extreme natural forces or by something beyond our current understanding. The lingering feeling is that Jupiter is about to become the ultimate witness to a phenomenon that humanity isn't quite ready to understand. We are watching a strange visitor pass through a cosmic gateway where gravity, heat, and geometry converge. What unfolds after this encounter may not only answer questions about the three-eye atlas, but also force us to rethink our own place in the vast enigmatic silence of the universe. Sometimes, what humans underestimate most is the silence of the universe. We live amidst constant sounds, signals, and disturbances, but out there, in the near absolute expanse of space, what truly governs all movement is not noise, but pure mathematics, orbits, symmetry, probability, and the cold, hard laws of physics operate in silence. In that context, the Three-Eye Atlas emerges as a puzzle written in the language of geometry and statistics, where every number has meaning and every small deviation can be a clue. Whether Three-Eye Atlas is an extremely rare coincidence with a 1 in 500 probability of nature accidentally creating a nearly perfect structure, or the remnants of a guardian from a civilization humanity will never encounter, its existence forces us to confront an unavoidable reality. Humanity is incredibly small on the scale of the universe, and our understanding of the interstellar space remains fragile, fragmented, and full of gaps. 3i Atlas isn't necessarily the answer, but it's certainly a question asked at the right time. What is remarkable is the way this object challenges familiar scientific intuition. For much of astronomical history, what defies conventional wisdom has often been gradually explained by new natural mechanisms, but rarely have they taken on such an orderly appearance that it suggests design. It is precisely this silence and precision that makes 3i Atlas so haunting. It doesn't signal, doesn't glow unusually, doesn't exhibit dramatic behavior, but simply quietly follows an inexplicable geometric structure, as if existing according to a set of rules we don't fully understand. Now, all eyes are on the data that will be sent back from the Juno mission in March. No hasty announcements, no premature conclusions. Scientists are waiting in tense silence, knowing that it is sometimes the quietest moments that bring discoveries capable of changing how we view the universe. Just a small deviation in orbit, an unusual acceleration signal in the gravitational field, or a subtle change in the structure of the gas streams could be enough to rewrite the entire story of 3i Atlas. Whatever the final outcome, the journey around this 0.2% figure has made one thing clear. Science is not just about finding answers, but about daring to question what doesn't fit the established norms. Following and supporting discoveries like this is how humanity continues to delve deeper into uncharted territories of knowledge, where the line between the known and the unknown remains blurred. The stars are still waiting silently and patiently as they have for billions of years, and so are we. While waiting for new data, the only certainty is that human curiosity is far from exhausted. Keep reflecting, keep asking questions, and as always, don't stop looking up at the starry sky because sometimes it is in that very silence that the greatest secrets of the universe are being revealed. If you find this journey of discovery fascinating, please subscribe to the channel and leave a comment sharing your thoughts. Your support and perspectives are what motivate us to continue delving deeper into unilluminated areas of knowledge.